Is that okay? Sir, can you repeat this point? Okay, so 16 bit. Mm, okay. पहले इसको वो देख लेते हैं क्या कहते हैं लॉजिकली देख लेते हैं डू यू रियलाइज दैट इन दिस वन पेज वन एरे आई कुड रीड ओनली वन बिट यस यस सर सो इफ आई हैव अ एट बिट वर्ड आई विल हैव टू हैव एट सच सर्किट्स देयर यस सर हां सो इफ आई हैव अ क्रॉस टू डी रैम देयर आर टू सच पेजेस If I have a cross four DRAM, four such pages, eight D cross eight DRAM, eight such pages. Banks. Let us call them. Let us call them as banks. Is that okay? Hello. Whatever Mr. is your bit Par bit. सर पर बैंक से अपन पहले में दो बीट निकाल रहे हैं और फोर एंड एट बीट ऐसे सर या बिकॉज़ देयर आर फोर सच पेजेस देयर आर फोर सेट्स ऑफ सेंस एम्पलीफायर्स देयर आर फोर देयर आर फोर सेट्स ऑफ डेटा बफर्स हां रो डिकोडिंग कुड स्टिल बी कॉमन बिकॉज़ सारे पेजेस पे सेम ही रो जाना है सारे पेजेस पे सेम ही कॉलम सेलेक्ट होना सो रो एंड कॉलम डिकोडिंग कुड स्टिल बी कॉमन आई हैव नॉट रिपीटेड देम यू नोटिस दिस ओके यस सर यस सर यस सर यही सर नंबर ऑफ बिट्स डाउन हो रहे हैं यस डिकोड करना हाउएवर इन अ रियल इंप्लीमेंटेशन यू मे नीड टू हैव रो डिकोडर्स अगेन एंड अगेन यू मे वांट टू शेयर देम अक्रॉस मल्टीपल ब्लॉक्स सो ओवर हियर लॉजिकली आई कुड शेयर देम अक्रॉस ऑल द ब्लॉक्स बट फिजिकली दैट वुड मीन लॉट ऑफ कैपेसिटेंसेस लॉट ऑफ आरसी टू हैंडल सो आई कुड रिपीट रो डिकोडर्स फोर टाइम्स इंस्टेड ऑफ एट टाइम्स column decoders four times instead of eight times because i could share those column decoders across two different pages are you able to see this now all yes, these row decoders actually get the same row address all the column decoders will get the same column address and therefore you could share them across multiple banks Hmm? Is it clear now? Hello. Any questions? So this is very different organization than what you have in the SRAM. That is why I am spending some time on it. i will not spend times on those structures or parts which are exactly the same or very similar to how we have in the sram but you do realize that this is a very different topology or very different memory organization so it is important that you understand this well is that okay sir hmm sir if there is a, a, a 4 mbit cross 4 then we will just take 1024 cross 1024 memory array and 10 bits each to decode so if it is 101 cross 4 then i would probably have just one block over here iske andar char pages aage mere char bits aa jayenge but since it is okay since it is 4 megabit total capacity and upon 4 i would say that each each of these things would be 256 256 k bits so 1k cross 1k ke aapke char sets banenge you are right okay. abhi yahan pe 512 cross 512 ke char sets hain agar ye cross 4 mein banaya gaya hota to 1k cross 1k ke char sets bante you are right and एक ही उसमें आपका काम चल जाता है एक ही ब्लॉक में आपका काम चल जाता है यस ओके यस सो अ लॉजिकल वे टू और द लॉजिकल डायग्राम ऑफ दिस अपीयर्स समथिंग लाइक दिस देर इज अ रीड एड्रेस स्ट्रोप देर इज अ कॉलम रो एड्रेस स्ट्रोप कॉलम एड्रेस स्ट्रोप राइट एनेबल 
output enable and then address bus and data bus. Okay. Now, since you, at any given point of time, you will either read or write into the DRAM. What have you done? You merged data buses into one. And we already discussed about how RA, RAS and CAS signals are used to merge or reduce, reduce the width of the address bus. Is it clear? In an SM also, you are either use the Q bus or the data bus, but you do not take make that kind of an effort because SRAMs are always embedded. DRAMs are usually main memories. They are off, off chip. So there is a very strong constraint on number of pins that you could have for the DRAMs. And therefore, everything is done to reduce the pin out of the DRAM there. Any questions? Okay. No, no sound means no questions then. So, two six K words, five and two cross five and two array. This is exactly this is the this is the logical diagram of this memory. You may say. Okay, this is logical diagram of that that memory, and uh, five and two bits are read out per page. We could say there are sixteen pages, so we kind of match that particular memory that we had, and a subset of bits are returned to the CPU. So the column decoder, there are multiple column decoders, and then the subset of these excesses are reported to the CPU. The key timings that are linked to a DRAM, TRAC, which is minimum time from read address strobe to data output. Hmm. TRC, which is minimum time between one read address strobe and another one. Okay. So in addition to whatever time it takes for a memory to give out data, TRC also involves pre-charge of the bit lines and reset of the memory circuits there. So TRC is greater than TRAC. Okay. And then T column address uh, strobe or TCAS is the minimum time from CAS to valid data. Now notice that if TRAC was 60 nanoseconds, this is much lower. Why? Because now, since amplifier output is already there, all that you need to do is do some address decoding and, and uh, select which bit to give out. Whereas for the, for the first timing, you not only had to uh, do the decoding of the row, array, row region, uh, that is the row decoder, but also discharge the bit line, activate the sense amplifier, and then give an output. So TRAC is therefore greater than uh, TCAS. Okay. And then TCC is the minimum time from the start of one column axis to the start of next. What do you think this would involve? Why do you think there is this extra gap between uh, TCAS and TCC? What extra stuff would be involved there? Refresh. Uh, no, refresh to aapne jab read kara to ho gaya, haath ke haath hi ho gaya tha. What could be the extra stuff involved there? Sorry. 
charging of bit lines uh when you change the column address uh, when you change the column addresses um uh, bit lines are not even being touched and amplifier operation has already happened it is more about resetting the state machine resetting the state machine so that the new decoding can now you know resetting the latches everything so that the new decoding can now start hmm? basically settling down i'm sorry basically settling down the yes huh now uh, there are two kinds of reads that could happen in a system in a dram we call them as early read or late read what does that mean so let us look at it over here so you gave read address, row address strobe and row addresses were put on the bus sense amplifiers were operated and something was done on the sense amplifiers some output is latched onto the sense amplifiers now after some time you give the column address strobe and after the column address decoding some output can be made available on the output bus what has happened even while you were still reading the rows output enable had gone to low so as soon as as soon as column addresses or sense amplifiers are selected the output can come out on the d out bus so there is one kind of timing over here this is called as early read where output enable was already low there was no no decision making done at that time in late read what happens is much after column address has been given so we assume that output was actually available in the memory but output enable went low much later in this case as soon as output enable went low data out will appear much faster so you see this duration is much smaller than this duration cas2 okay this is called as late read abhi you are not probably able to understand what is the benefit of late read but when we will talk about Uh, you know uh, architectural ways to recover speed or recover performance of drams then this concept of early read and late read will come into picture so just keep this in mind that there are two kinds of reads early reads and late reads and i tell you that over here since the bus is in high impedance zone for a large part of the time the bus could be used by something else that is the hinter there okay and then you do the late read is that okay early read late read mein farak samajh mein aa gaya is that part clear friends we are not in a physical class where i could see your faces and know if you have understood or not we are still in an online class sir sure. yes please sure. ask Why did column? I, I sorry, sir. I do not understand. Why did column address came first? Sorry. Okay, okay. I am looking at it from my my bad. Column address came at the same time. Output enable was low earlier, and in the other case, output enable came low much after the column address or CAS had come. So why why was the enable? later in second so that is what i said the reason of this why we will talk about later but do okay. we understand the functionality okay yes. there is a benefit of this we will talk about that later but do we understand the functionality part of it huh there are two different timings one timing is much shorter than the other timing okay yes sir similarly for write there could be early write or late write in the sense that 
the data could be latched uh, the data could be latched as soon as uh, it it appeared and the column address appeared or as soon as cas came or uh, you know the write operation can start right away or data could be latched and write operation would start later because again for some reason we will talk about that reason later but just like for over there we had the dependence on arrival time of oel over here we have the dependence on arrival time of wel hmm okay 